Yo, what is good, YouTube, and welcome back to another JC2K video. In today's video, we're doing gameplay with the brand new Amethyst Kimba Walker. And I will preface this video by saying Kimba himself is probably not that good of a card, at least for an online PG. He's small, he can't dunk, and he's not a good defender. Those three things are like the three biggest flaws you can have as a point guard for the most part. He will be a fun shot creator, shooting point guard, but overall, he's not that good online. But like Trey Young, Steph Curry, Kyrie Irving, fun card even if he isn't all that good doesn't have the athleticism the defense or the size as a whole should be a fun card to use before we hop into the video if you haven't already make sure you hit that subscribe button help me push towards the 16,000 subscriber mark on the channel trying to hit that by the end of the year we're less than 500 subscribers away got a couple weeks to do it i think it's very doable so really appreciate it if y'all do subscribe and without further ado kemba is a six foot pg like i said very small but 93 offense 86 defense 90 driving layup 90 close shot midi and three ball as well as free throw uh can't dunk the ball at all though 95 ball handle 89 pass accuracy is good but defensively not great 84 perimeter is okay but 93 speed super ball excel very very good 88 verticals fine 94 stamina is fine 87 lateral is also fine problem with this guard is badge wise it's all offensive finishing shooting and playmaking stuff he's got two hops which are agent three hyperdrive uh he's got gold acrobat fast twitch pro touch blinders catch and shoot dead eye limitless range ankle breaker bailout break stutter dimer handles for days uh needle thudder unpluckable bunny flow game scooper spin cycle whistle three points big driver blow by speed booster silver or triple strike silver slithery guard up pogo stick two-step relay passer bronze green machine pick dodger spot finder i mean a lot of good offensive badges but unfortunately he doesn't have the dunking ability offensively and defensively he just doesn't have anything he's got like silver pogo stick and bronze pick dodger and that's it on the defensive end that is just not going to get the job done especially at six foot with that being said kimba's movement is very very good he's got very very good animations as a whole and i think kimba kimba's movement is one of the better things about the card so he's going to be able to dribble and shot create at a very very high level and uh, that's a huge plus for this card release is also super duper nice so with him having Hoff agent three Hoff hyper drives pretty good obviously all pretty much all the gold playmaking shooting badges that you could ask for of course as well Kemba with a nice release good movement and all those badges should be a really good three hunter unfortunately the three hunting play style just isn't that effective right now it's the biggest is really the most unfortunate part of it I think his fade is normal fade I'm not even a, totally 100% sure let's see let's try that again see what fade he's got is it normal I think it's normal is that normal I'm not even totally sure I'm not 100% certain I think that's normal fade uh, regardless very very good fade Kemba's going to be a great card uh, as a shot creator and a shooter but that's about all he can do unfortunately so should be fun to use but as a competitive level point guard definitely not a guy I'd recommend with that being said let's hop into a game let's see what Kemba can do Oh yeah, Kemba played D first possession. Let's go. He's hooping on Harden so far. 10 seconds into the shot clock. Hasn't gotten me enough to dribble yet. Oh my goodness, you're a dog. Oh, block. Yes, we got the block. Kemba with the board. What a W first possession. He looks really small because that's James Harden, who's like 6'5". And yes, Harden has a pretty good player build, but 6'5 versus six foot i don't that that looks like a i don't know maybe that is a five to five inch difference but it looks bigger than that with that being said kemba attack chill dump down d rob easy layup good pass first possession we will take our layup i am willing to have six assists and three points with kemba if that's what it takes to win the game i just want to make sure i can win and winning with kemba might require passing the ball a lot but we're definitely going to try to get the shots off that was not a good decision at all i gotta chill on that and a taller player does get that steal as well which is really unfortunate but good d braun look at braun getting bumpy and stealing that throw it up to Kemba Kemba he's gonna jump right yep he did jump but uh same side burst here chill back to the left yes sir back to the right I should say wall up here get inside for a I wanted a I was trying to shoot a mid-range I was trying to get the crab do like a fat stop and get a crab there but did not get the spacing that I wanted shot creation three hunting in this game is really really tough it just is it's just hard to create open shots right now with the way that the movement is the way that the off-ball defense is really the way the defense versus offense is in general it can be very tough to uh, get that type of shot open but we're trying our best good move Kemba oh that was so tough and I got a wide open three out of it too and didn't hit it those are the ones that we have to hit that's like a that's just such a wasted opportunity which is a real shame to be honest uh, because oh what am i doing defensively we're lucky he can't shoot because yikes we, we just both both missed wide open shots those last two possessions uh back to the right same side burst now kimba he's getting tired is the main thing that i'm starting to get a little worried about and then i throw a turnover as well it's just if the play style of the game enabled three hunting to be better a guy like kemba would be a little bit more viable kind of like steph and Kyrie were super duper viable viable in season one because of how good they were uh as three hunters in a game that rewarded three hunting the game doesn't reward three hunting anymore so it has become very very tough i would say to use these three hunting type of players especially when they're so weak in other areas good pass to the we'll take our second assist um and it's just i don't think they separate themselves enough anymore especially uh 
uh, with the way that the game is played or has to be played with the way that the gameplay is. Um, it makes it very hard to use a guy like him because he's a liability defensively and offensively. He's not really doing anything unless you are hitting your marks perfectly with the way the, the lag can be and the animations and stuff. Like it can be tough to time everything properly and get off of bursts and get through bumps. And I just, it's tough. Shot creation is tough. And maybe it's, it's to a certain extent, it's a skill thing as well, I guess, but uh, it can be tough to use these types of guys. That's just that's just the truth of it right now. So Kemba sizing up here, dragging back. I would love to shoot if I could, but haven't been able to really get the space here, getting through the screen here, hit our pop, Giannis catch and shoot, and I'll take another assist, I guess. Three assists on the game for Kemba. We're shot creating pretty well. It's just tough to shot create for yourself. He's got a couple turnovers as well, although those were simply from me just throwing some questionable passes, trying to force some stuff in there and get some stuff working. He does get downhill for the dunk that time, and I think that was only his second bucket. So we are only up by too but i will take a lead regardless and kemba rejects the screen here stop pop kemba that's enough space that's got to be green there we go let's go kemba big play got hardened into the screen knocking down a three five point lead that's what it should have happened the first time that i got the wide open three that i missed but we will take that one don't get back door it here wall up here kemba you can compete good d kemba that was actually pretty solid i'm not gonna lie he didn't get beat off the dribble really at all good shot pg he drilled that okay it's a good shot it was deep and it was almost it looked like it was going to be contested, so I, I, give, I give credit. I'm glad that was open, though, because generally I would expect the game to honestly register that as a contest, and it shouldn't be a contest, I don't think, anyway. So I'm a fan of that not being contested, even though it wound up actually costing me on that spot. Uh, D-Rob is also... That one was a contest, unfortunately. That was a questionable shot. Really shouldn't have shot it. I'm um, going to need Kemba to do me a favor here. Good D, our test. Let's go. We closed out. Good way to close out and jump without fouling as well. Uh, love to see that. Same side burst. Attack the rim. Kemba out to D-Rob. D-Rob for the three, and it's late again. No way. Shot gets sped up two plays in a row. That's really tough. Step up here. Kemba I gets blown right by. He just can't guard anybody. Like, he cannot guard a soul. He's got three points, three assists. He's assisted and scored on all of our possessions, but I can't attack the rim with him because he just can't do that, really. So I guess I can run the pick and pop and try to get hardened behind me, but then if I attack the rim, I'm going to get blocked. Exactly. So I could, I, if I had just been a little more patient there, maybe it works out, but that was going to be tough regardless, I think, unfortunately. Um... It just attack of the rim with Kemba is, 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 is a tough proposition for sure with how small he truly is and the inability to dunk the ball at all. I needed LeBron to contest better there. And now we are down by two. Way to give up a seven to nothing run and throw the game. Size up here. Kemba doesn't get through anything. Off to the pop. D-Rob. Chill. Same side burst here. I can't even get the burst going. All right. Pick and pop. Um, he's up on me. Get through the screen here. Attack. Downhill. Bow, out to the pop. D-Rob for three. Come on, D-Rob. Bro, I can't shoot. Just can't time shots. Like, I don't even know what you want me to say, man. Just lost to this st stuff. That's so annoying. Like, that pass was so bad. Kimba just can't. He got tired, and then you can't shot create with him at the end of the game. By the time when he runs out of stamina, he's completely useless because you can't attack the room with him and you can't three hunt either. He just isn't good enough. He's not. Like, he's just not good enough to be worth using, really, in, at an online level against somebody who knows what they're doing. And I know I missed an open shot, but still. It's tough to use him. If I had used a bigger PG, I'd win that game by 10 points. So I, I don't know. I just think that Kemba is in a situation where if you're trying to run your offense through a card like this right now, it's very, very tough to do unless you are truly one of the very best players in the entire world. And even then, if you're playing somebody good at the game, it is very tough to run this type of offense and use a guy like Kemba effectively, unfortunately. So that's just the truth of the card, though. Uh, and that's just my personal opinion. It's not a card I'd recommend picking up personally. Fun offline card, but online specifically, not a card I'd recommend. So with that being said, that is going to do it for this video. So I hope you all did enjoy. If you did, make sure you hit that like button, leave a comment and subscribe. I'll be back with more 2K content very, very soon. And I appreciate y'all. Peace.